Sorry. And they are not on you. Must be one here somewhere. As soon as I can see it, I can try and get to it. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Oh, don't hit them. They'll be angry. The truth is here somewhere. Oh, fuck. Sorry, sorry. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Like shining somewhere. It must be inside then. There's an entrance right there. There we go. Safe. Where is it? Where is it? Where? 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 I am looking for the truth, and the truth is hidden. I might have to look them up. Somewhere around here. Hmm. Hello, horse. Um. I think that's where the waypoint is up there. Huh. Let's climb up here. Can I get up there? I can. And do this then. I found it! There it is. Hidden. Power doesn't die. It's passed on. What? Okay. Unlock the files, descendants. There it is, the Apple of Eden. Is that all I've got to find, the Apple of Eden? Say hello. This is easy. Say hello. Using infrared, you can see it. Clever. File and lock, so you get a little lot more. So eventually, I'll play it like a short film. That's kind of cool. I'm looking forward to seeing all of that. And I, again, there's another thing I'll, I plan on finding. All love. Come on. Uh, fuck's sake. I have to go around. I'll just go over this side and do this side. Sorry, I'm not religious. I'm just borrowing your perch. Horsey, horsey, horse. Where have I put you? You're somewhere around here. You were following me. Where have you gone? Where have you gone, little horse? Have you run off? Have you despawned or something? I want to find another one if you have. Am I dreaming this? No, you're not. I need a horse. Leave me alone. Huh. I'm looking for a new horse. 
In later games you can call horses, but in this one it seems like they haven't had, they didn't let it in. Must be one of those things they like they decided on after the success of the first game. Or well, the first the second game really. Um right, let's decide where to go next. Uh this one. Which direction is that? Is this very good? Head this way. And hopefully we'll find a horse. I don't want to run all the way there. It'll be boring. Uh, excuse me. Alright. I have gone mad. Thank you. Horse easy run off. You disappeared. Yeah, it's a long run now. Du, 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 du. People spawning in. Any horses spawning in I can use? Any horses here? I really need one. Any horses I can use? Doesn't seem like there are. I need to know my time for my video. Yeah, we're at an hour and seven minutes. I've got 13 more minutes. In that case, I really do need to find a horse. Just to make things move faster, I suppose. At least I can say the video hasn't crashed. Uh, you shouldn't have said that yet, though. Because if you're superstitious, people are going to. Uh, you'll know that saying that before it's something's. before it's definitely not going to happen, just makes it more likely to happen. Anyway. Right. Do that. Um, any horses around? Still no. Where am I going now? Is that we're done? So two more. That one next. I will have to detour and find a horse if I don't. If there isn't one near here, that is irritating. The one at the first one, it's not fair. Why'd my horse have to despawn? I was just, I was just searching for the truth. Um go over here, there should be I just want to eat. You're fine, run off. God. Here. 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 It's a nice noise. Can't see where I'm going though. Oh, that's a wall. Right, you stay here, eat some hay. I'll be right back. Don't neigh at me. Eat your hay. Hey, it's rude. I'm good at what I do. Car tutu. There we go. I'm gonna name my horse. Just this one, because I hopefully have him for a little bit longer. I'm gonna name you. 
Uh, in honour of how I met your mother, I'm going to name you Barney. Come on, Barney. Turn around. No, no. Barney, Barney. This way. Come on. Turn around. Let me go. There we go. Right. Uh, where's this last waypoint? Just here. Right, so there's this bit here that soon is unlocking. And then no more waypoints. Alright, where are we going? Alright, Barney, this way. Go gallop there. Hey, look, Barney, another horse friend. And doing it in honor of how I met your mother because I've been watching it a lot recently. I can see where I'm going to be needing to go, I think. Yeah, right here. Alright, Barney, you stay here. No, get down. Ezio, leave the horse alone. He, the horse can't help us climb up, so there's no point in trying to climb back on him. Uh. The, this map bit of that's getting filled out. Are you. Uh, is he drawing the map by looking everywhere, or is he just like building it in his mind, or what? I don't see how doing this helps with the map. Alright, is that it? Let's have a look. Everywhere seems to be in cupboard except for this. Hmm. Alrighty then. Seems like everything. So we're gonna head back this way towards Claudia. Alright, get out of there. Come on, Barney. Are you ready to go? I've done everything I need to do now. The sad thing is, or the annoying thing is, it's really far away now. I have to do all this traveling again. It's a good job. Traveling on Barney is fast. Uh, pegs it down this way. <sighs> there's, there's almost nothing to talk about on like traveling, I suppose. I suppose it's near the end of the episode, though. Very soon. Give it another ten-ish minutes. And Jump that and jump that. Oh, I'm tired. Where's my red laser that like, goes to bed? Ah. Oh, look how fast that was. Nearly there already. Yes. Cloak over the shoulder? Nope, didn't have to have time. Let's go see Claudia. It's a bit. Yeah, let's go see Claudia. I see what's up with her. And. We're here. Alright, thank you very much, Barney. So we're going to have to go the rest by foot. Oh, it's fine, Barney. It's fine. Go check on Claudia. I'm going. Make sure she's not running back onto Florence to see... Well, she didn't have a boyfriend. We beat him up. Um, to uh, see her friends, I suppose. Is she in here? Or is she upstairs? She is. She's right there. Salute, Claudia. Our uncle is un monstro. This is outrageous. What's happened? He's making me work. If father was here, I'd never be stuck behind a desk like this. And what are the terms of this supposed enslavement? Since someone decided we're going to stay here, Zio Mario suggested we try and find the money to repair the villa. Problem is, there isn't any. I bet I can bring in some money. Oh, great. More work for me. Well, benissimo. 
If you start paying for improvements to the town, I'll keep track of them in this book. And since I have nothing better to do, I'll also make note of any objects you bring in from the outside. If you actually get this place up and running, travelers might visit and spend money. Although I doubt anyone will want to come this far out of the city. But if they do, I'll keep the money we make in this chest. You're going to have to show up to take it to the bank yourself. Because when it gets full, I'm just going to take the extra cash for myself. Capito? Dio. <laughs> okay, I don't have any money. Okay. A few more minutes. Talk to Villa's architect. Where is he? Oh, he's there. Oops. Hi, guy. Buongiorno. Is there something wrong? Yes, sir. Mario hired me to deal with this mess, but I'm an architetto, not a miracle worker. Without money, I can't fix any of these buildings. I don't have any money at the moment. Someone brought you money. Eh, then we'd be in business. Uh, you must be Serezio. Am I right? You are indeed. Uncle, I like this architetto. He gets very observant when he can smell money. If you want to fix up this town, I'm going to need it. I have a price list here for new shops and renovations. Just bring me gold, make a choice, and I'll begin at once. If I build you a shop, you, as the landlord, can purchase goods there at lower rates. If you invest more money in the shop, you get an even greater discount. As for renovations, well, you'll be bringing the town and villa back to life. As Sir Mario tells me, that was very important to your great-great-grandfather. Plus, when you buy shops and renovations, you'll be increasing the number of people who visit, causing your income to increase. So, let's take a look, shall we? Sure. I don't have any money at the moment, though. Everything's too expensive. I only have 300 at the moment. Okay. What's that? I need more money first. Let's go see... I'm, go I'm supposed to Mario? Yes. It's you, my boy. I think it's time I showed you something. Oh no, I'm worried now. Oh, okay, never mind. It's fine. Just a secret door. Could have been something a lot worse. It's an awesome secret door, though. I'm coming, I'm coming. Yeah, just stop getting stuck. Awesome. Ooh. It's glowing. Alright, Mario. What is this place? What? This is the sanctuary. It was built by my great-grandfather to honor the memory of the Assassin Order and protect its secrets. Look around. These are the Assassins who guarded the freedom of humanity when it was most threatened. And this is the armor of Altair. Little is known about Altair's life, but his armor is light and very strong. I give it to you, but I don't know how to retrieve it. My great-grandfather told me it would remain locked away until all its protectors were made whole. I heard rumors of crypts located throughout Italia. Hidden tombs filled with treasure where these six were moved centuries ago. Maybe they have something to do with it. In my younger days, I sought these six myself. With no success. Perhaps you will have better luck. Maybe I will. In order to achieve perfect synchronization with Ezio, you have to get that armor. Okay. Okay.
Okay. Um, what's our time limit at? If we are at 21 minutes, it's perfect. 20 minutes, 40 seconds. Alright then. So that is about it. About all we have time for, I suppose. Um, next episode, we will maybe go see Da Vinci if we can. If that's what we need to do. We've got all those codex pages and everything that's sorted. Got a few more than that. Ready? Uh, there's that stuff. So we need to go. What's our next mission? It's probably to go see Da Vinci. Probably. Alright then, so next time we'll go do that. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Uh, I enjoyed playing. And I guess we'll see you. Well, I, I will see you with Ezio in the next episode. Until then, goodbye Cubs.